When a bird flushes in front of a right-handed shooter and goes around his right side, it's very typical to want to keep your eye on that bird and try to follow that bird around to the right. And by doing so, your feet are going to get tangled up into the cover that you're in because you have to keep moving to your right side. A right-handed shooter always wants to shoot with his left foot forward in order to make a steady and balanced shot. So take that extra step with your right foot, pivot to the opposite side or your left side, and let that bird come into view from your blind side. The opposite of that approaching target is the same target but only coming from behind you. That one's a little bit easier to negotiate because you're always going to be able to see that bird on top of your barrel, but it requires a reverse lead. The target will go over your head, you come up from behind the target, swing through the target, and when you see the target sitting on top of your barrel, you might even have to pull a little bit lower to make that intersection of your shot string and the bird's path. Go to a Sporting Clays course, get underneath the duct tower and have them throw birds away from you over your head. It's a good way to practice for the field. I'm Tom Knapp for Benelli's American Safari and remember, think safety first and then have a good hunt.